Hey guys and welcome back to another Unreal Engine Marketplace video. It's come to that time of year again where we're now doing the Black Friday sale on the Unreal Engine Marketplace where you can save up to 70% on nearly 2,700 different assets on the Marketplace from now until the 3rd of December which is going to be the next Sunday. So you've got quite a while for this sale which is always great and again there's so many different assets for you to choose from and to look at to see what you want to buy. So if there's been something you've had your eye on for a while, now is the perfect time to get it as it could be all the way up to 70% off. But what I'm going to be doing today is just showcasing the top 10 assets that I found and again there's thousands more that are on the page so make sure to look for yourself as well but these are the top 10 which I found which I want to show off and showcase today. So without further ado, let's just get right into it starting with the modular building system. Now this is something which I believe I've showcased before on the channel and I've definitely showcased stuff from this developer before because I love what they make and it's all great and this one is the modular building system and this is an advanced component based building system that saves you countless hours of programming. Start focusing your time on programming gameplay built off of the backbone of this advanced system instead. So this features component based snap points, snapped place, free place and rotate objects, different connection sizes. You can import custom models to use for this, it doesn't just have to be the ones used in the video that you can see on screen now. You can pick up, place, drop and throw objects and it also has in-game building so this isn't just something to do in the editor, it's in-game as well. There are 23 blueprints with this and the input is keyboard and mouse and this is not network replicated. I think this one looks absolutely amazing, it's really useful if you wanted to create obviously a modular building system as you can see here, it's a great starting point to do that and this can be a starting point for you to build on and expand upon or you can just use this straight out of the box as it is and just put it into your game for your players to use as well. This is absolutely perfect and I love this one. This is normally £20 but on sale it is £14. That is a saving of 30% off. Next up we've got the stylized kingdom environment, Skyrich Kingdom, Modular Castle and Cathedral. So this allows you to create epic fantasy worlds with ease unleash your creativity with our massive Unreal Engine Castle Environment Pack. And this is Nanite and Lumen compatible. It is crafted with meticulous attention to detail and it is designed for seamless customization and optimal performance. This monumental collection boasts close to 1400 high quality meshes. So this has fully modular buildings with interiors, it's got a gothic cathedral, mountain environment, custom water shader, charming shops, imposing statues, an eerie graveyard and crypts, and even a bandit camp. So this also features 20 minor miscellaneous props from previous asset packs that they've created as well. They've just chucked in and included in this pack here. So in total there is 1374 unique meshes, a fully modular castle and environment design, waterfall material and VFX, spline based stylized river creator, next gen auto landscape material with 8 layers, fully procedural terrain texturing with parallax occlusion and bump offset support, written from the ground up for scalability, ease of use and performance. This is suitable for large open worlds as well as suitable for all platforms. There is a stylized water shader, custom optimized LODs, customizable materials including color palettes and wind settings and an open world demo scene is included as well. So as I've said there's 1,349 unique meshes, that goes along with 259 materials and material instances, 801 textures and the text resolutions are 256 by 256 up to 4k. So I think this one looks absolutely fantastic if this is the style of thing you want in your game. This is perfect, there's so much in this and you can really tell the attention to detail that's gone into it. Normally this is £230 but on sale it is £160. Now we have the Ultimate Worlds Spawn System. So this allows you to quickly build and populate your world. This asset presents a fully fledged AI spawn system with optimization and the main types of spawn is a spline and you can also choose a spawn zone in the form of a box with the possibility of rotation or even a sphere and you'll immediately see the results as the assets adapted to work in a construction script. So as I've mentioned there's three types of spawn in this which is a spline, sphere or a box a fully fledged AI spawn system. The things you can spawn in are actors, sprites, pawns, particles and Niagara systems. You can respawn with the ability to set a limit on the assets that I just mentioned a second ago that can be spawned in. 
There's two spawn modes, so you can do that in on the land or in the air. This is also compatible with world partition and world composition, which is something these packs aren't normally able to do, but this one can. This is also network replicated. As well as this, you can add a behavior tree for the pawn type or not, and you can also multi-level spawn, which means you can spawn on top of already spawned objects if you wanted to, or you can turn that off. So that means you can make an entire wall of actors instead of just having one level. You can also choose actors that you want to exclude from spawning in. Now there's a lot of other stuff to talk about on this, but the video just really shows it off the best. Normally this is £47, but on sale it is £23. Next up, we've got the Modular Ancient Ruins. This asset pack will help you create atmospheric levels for your projects. This includes over 400 high quality assets that are ready to drop into your project, and it contains all the tools needed, including modular architecture pieces, props, vegetations, trees, cliffs and rocks, customizable materials and material instances, animated winds on plants, particle systems for birds and smoke, and automatically generated collision. So this features two maps, 405 meshes, automatically generated collision, automatically generated LODs, nine materials and 108 material instances, three particles, 25 blueprints, and 266 textures with resolutions ranging from 512 up to 2K. Once again, not a lot to talk about on this one, but you can really see it in the video on screen now of the high quality assets that you're gonna be getting in this pack for you to be able to make a modular ancient ruins environment. Normally this is £71 but on sale it is £50. Now we've got Undead Hunchback. So this is 54 animations for your hunched back undead characters. So I know Halloween has been and gone however people will still be making horror games or games with zombies in or whatever it is that you want to use these animations for. So the animation list is obviously on the Marketplace page if you want to read the full list because there's 55 animations, so I'm not going to read them all now, but I'll go through some of them. And the animations that are here are also supplied in both root motion and in place depending on which one you want. So they've been categorized into unaware animations, aware animations, actions and human. So you've got idle, walking forward, backwards, left and right. You've got turning left and right. You've got running. You've got walking forwards and backwards, you've got a rising face down, face up, biting, and then you've also got the human reaction to being bit, you've got striking, transforming, and lots of different variations of each one in here as well. So this is rigged to the epic skeleton as you can obviously see in the video, and it does also include IK bones. There are 55 animations, with the animation types being both root motion and in place, and there is one character included in this. Normally this is £20 but on sale it is £13. Now we've got the industrial area. This is an old abandoned industrial area environment which includes photo scanned game ready buildings and props. So this features modular buildings, props such as asphalt roads, fences, concrete pieces, ladders and more, foliage and also a demo map to be able to see what it is that you can create with this asset pack. In total, there are 62 unique meshes, all of which have custom or automatically generated collision. The vertex count ranges from 175 to 15,988, which is very, very good. There are LODs, and there are 62 materials and material instances with 152 textures, with the text resolutions ranging from 512 up to 4K. As with most of the environment packs, there's not a lot to say on them, as I've said many times in this video, because it is really, you see what you get, and you can see in this video that these are very high quality assets. As they've said, this, the, as I've said already, these are photo scanned game ready buildings and props for you to use in your game. Normally this is £66, but on sale it is £33. Now we've got the generic futuristic concept drivable car. So this is a futuristic car with multiple different textures on it that you can swap in and out, and it's also drivable already to use in game too. So this includes a drivable blueprint, 10 different textures including taxi, police and sheriff, two rim types, two steering wheels, one engine and one suspension. Now this part you're going to want to listen to because these are quite big numbers. So the geometry for this are there's 473,000 vertices, 941,000 edges, 468,000 faces and 936,000 triangles. Now that is quite a lot. However, cars are normally quite high in these numbers, 
and if this is going to be the main part of your game you're going to be driving this car that will typically be fine because the main thing in your game like a player or anything on the player you want to be very highly detailed but this is just something you want to keep in mind if you're going to be using this because those are quite high numbers so there's one blueprint in this and the controls to drive the car are also listed on the marketplace page there's 26 master materials and 54 instances and 20 material slots with 370 textures with a text resolution all being 4k this is normally 28 pounds but on sale it is 20 pounds now we've got the swamp goblin now this is going to be a very quick one and this is a fantasy character with pbr textures suitable for your projects of genre fps tps rpg and horror so this is rigged and it is rigged to the epic skeleton as you can see in the video now the animations being used are just the ue4 mannequin animations so there are no animations included in this other than the default UE4 ones, but again, the character is rigged for you to use your own animations on it. There's five materials and material instances with 15 textures, and the text resolutions are all 4K. Normally, this is £38, but on sale, it is £19. Next up, we've got the Roads Pack. So this is a set of content for creating roads and road infrastructures. Splines, road signs, textures, and road surface materials with the ability to add puddles, decal road markings and the starter environment content, landscape material and grass, trees and stones are all included. So this features splines designed for use with the landscape spline tool, a large selection of basic road signs, high quality road signs and sign textures, and materials adapted for roads with settings for creating puddles and wetness on these roads as well. There are 490 unique meshes with variations and attached details, with nature 539, and in total there is 1,663 meshes in the pack. All of these meshes do have automatically generated collision and custom collision for the road splines. There are 12 master materials and 1,616 material instances in total in the pack. There's 2,416 textures with the resolutions ranging from 256 all the way up to 8K. And so the size of this pack is 22 gigabytes. That's probably because they've got 8K textures and so many textures themselves as well, and a lot of meshes. So this is quite a big pack, but as you can see from the video, it's very high quality and it looks really, really good. Normally this is 57 pounds, but on sale it is 17 pounds. And finally, last but not least, we have the Environment Bundle V1. So this is the Environment Bundle, which contains Tomato City and Neon City which allows you to save $30 buying this pack instead of buying them separately. So in total there are 197 unique meshes all of which have collision on them and the vertex count says ranges from between 80 to 5 million. So because of that it's highly recommended to use Nanite with some of these assets as well because that will then really help to render in and load those assets. There's 182 materials and material instances with 468 textures with the text resolutions being 1K, 2K and 4K. Obviously if you want more detailed breakdowns of what's in these packs then you can go onto the marketplace page that I've linked in the description and from there you can find the Neon City Cyberpunk pack and the Tomato City Environment Wonderland which are the two included in this bundle. The one you can see on screen now is obviously the Neon City Cyberpunk pack. Normally this is £95, on sale it is £47. And with that, I think that will conclude my Black Friday Marketplace video for this year. Again, I've covered 10 different assets which I've found, and there's thousands more on the Marketplace page for you to look through as well, but these are just the top 10 which I've seen. So thank you so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed this video, and I hope you did find it helpful of me just showcasing these packs. Make sure to link any more in the comments down below that you found and you really like and you want to show off to other people as well. And also the links to all the assets which I've spoken about today will be in the description down below. So again, thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, please do make sure to like and subscribe down below as it really does help me and the channel out a lot. So thank you so much for watching and I will see you in the next one.